And then if you're me, when somebody gives you a compliment, what do you have to do? You have to say thank sorry thank or thank you. Thank, thank, you. thank, thank you. you. Or thanks, right? Okay. There are two things that you need to know. Why is there look and looks? What if you have sneakers? Do you say look or looks? No, no S. Very good. Okay. What if you have t-shirt? Are you going to say look or looks? Looks. looks. Any questions so far? Yes or no? No. Okay. Am I too fast or slow or just okay? Just okay. okay. All right. Good. Another thing that I want you guys to know is here. So you have to put an adjective here. For example, looks amazing, right? Okay. Another word that you can put over there. Give me ten. Uh, give me an answer. I'll give you ten points. Looks amazing. What else? Looks. Yes. Beautiful. Okay. You can use beautiful. What else? Say stop. Oliver. Handsome. Looks handsome. I'll give you five points, but for clothes, you don't say look handsome. Your face will look handsome, but your clothes cannot be handsome, okay? But good try. Say stop. Stop. Neil. Wonderful. Wonderful, okay. I'll call you. You don't know minus 20. There's beautiful, wonderful, what else? There are so many answers. Do you need to talk, yes or no? No. No? Who needs to talk? Nobody? Nobody? Nobody needs to talk about the answer? Okay, three, two, one. Thomas. Pretty. Okay. I would like to teach you a new word, okay? This weird this sound this word sounds strange. It's sick. So in America when something is very cool, people will say, hey, that's sick. Okay, that means that's very cool. It doesn't mean you have a fever or you have a cough. It just means that it's very cool. Do you understand, yes or no? Yes. So later for your conversation, you can use that. Okay? All right, we have five parts. We're done with part one. Can we go to part two, yes or no? Yes. yes. All right. So after you give a compliment, what are you going to do? So you already know that it's nice, but you don't know if it is new. Very good. New or old. So you want to find out if it's new or old. So if you want to find out if it's new or old, you're going to say blah 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 new. And you can use is or are. And then for this one, you can use this or that or these or those. Blah 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 new. And then be long. Okay, so for this part, just remember this and that is for tansu or usu. Tansu. These, those. Usu. Okay, tansu or usu. Usu. And that is part two. Any questions so far? Yes or no? No. no. Okay. May I erase part one? Yes. 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 Okay, let's go to part three. Okay, after you know if it's yes. And I know if it's yes, sure. No, it's okay. I'll give you ten points. Smart question. So Thomas said, can I use the here? Of course you can, sure, okay? All right, let's go to part three. So now you know if it's new or old. What's the next thing you want to know? When? Before when? It starts with an R. How? Part? Yes. When? Where? No, it starts with, yes, reason. Okay, very good. If it was bought recently or not. So what are you going to? Say, we're going to say blah 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 recently. If it is recently over here, what is the first word? Did. Did. Very good. Did you? You can use what two words? Yes. 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 Or yes. I. And of course, you can use. 
use this, that, these, those, but we can also use the timings, right? Yes or no? Yes. yes. So what timings is can you put here? If it is singular, if it is tan su, what do you do? Say stop. Stop. Yes. <laughs> Only one say stop. <laughs> Just it. It. Very good. But if it is plural or fu su, say stop. stop. Oliver. Then. Yeah. Okay, and then when you answer, you'll say yes. I here is get and buy, but because you're answering, there's no did over here, so you'll say yes, I got or I called. Okay, for this part, the only thing I want you guys to remember is if you use did, you have to use what? Right? Yeah. Yeah. So it becomes get or buy, not got or bought. Any questions so far? Yes or no? no. That's part three. Can I go or stop? Go. Right. Let's go to part four. So three down, two more parts to go. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Yes. Right. After you know if it's recently or not, what's the next word? When. So you know it's recently, but you don't know when. when. You know it was bought recently, but you don't know when. So the next step is you're going to ask them when that thing was bought. So if we have when, what's the next word, everyone? Everyone, okay? When? Did. Okay. When did, and then you have the two, right? And then because we have did again, do you say get or got, everybody? Get. 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 Buy or bought? Buy. And for this part, do you need to write yes or no? No. 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 Okay. And the last part is because somebody is asking you when, you need to tell us the time, right? Okay, so some of the times we have learned. The first way is you can say last, right? Yes. Okay, yes. so last, we have last, everybody last, and, and, night. Please don't forget, you cannot say yesterday night, okay? Yes. Okay, next one. You can also say last week. Week. Last weekend. 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 okay. And last M. Month. Month. Can you say last year for recently, yes or no? No. no? no. So don't put last year over there. Do you understand? Okay. okay. Another one is you can use the word blah, 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 ago. So another way to say yesterday is? Last night. No, another way to say yesterday one is ago. One, one day, day or ago. a day ago. Okay. So you can also have two week or weeks. Week. Week. Okay. I'm going to teach you something new, okay? Yes. If it is on the same day, but not too long ago, maybe uh, 8 o'clock this morning, okay? How do you say that? You say, just a while ago. Or, just a moment ago. Do you understand? Yes or no? Okay? Everything's all good? Everything's good? Yes. yes. Four down, let's go to part five. Can I go or stop? Go. go. Okay, after you know when it was bought, if your friend has those shoes, do you want those shoes too, yes or no? No. Yes. no. Why not? Uh, I don't understand. Uh, the color or the color or something, but you say they're cool. So most of the time you will say, yes, I want the same shoes, okay? All right, so if you want to have the same shoes, 
what questions do you need to know? What questions do you need to know? Where? 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 Where that person bought it. You also need to know the price. Do you know price? So you have to ask how much. Much. So you say, where did you buy or get it or that? And then you say, how much is it? If it is singular, if it is plural, how much are they? Any questions so far? No. Am I too fast? No. No? Are you sure? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's go to letter D. So you come up, where did you get them? So you say, I bought or got or not. And I think this part is easy. The only grammar thing, the only grammar point that I want to point out is this, okay? If you didn't buy it, and somebody gave it to you. You can say, my mom bought or got it. Yeah. What word are you going to use here? For or to? For. 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 But if you want to say, my mom, this time you use the word gave it. What word are you going to use there? To. Are there any questions about this? Yes or no? No. Okay. Quiz time. Do you need one minute to study, yes or no? Yes. yes. Okay, I'll give you one minute to so take a look at your notes. After one minute, you take the quiz, okay? One minute. And stop. Numbers one and two, that's letter L, okay? That's not letter I, letter L.
you have to read and then you will know. Look at the conversation. No, what? Number six is bonus. If your question is about number six, it's bonus, okay? You don't need to write anything. Yes. What? Number three? Here. Number three is over here. It's the start of the sentence. This all. You get it? you have to write two words, okay? Number five, you have to write two words. Yes. Number five, yeah. is doing 1 to 15, 20, uh, 16 to 25, finish. Who is doing 6 to 15? 16 to 25. Finish. If you have finished, please take out your novel and read. Right, 
Groups one and two, please pass it counterclockwise. Three and four, counterclockwise. Five, counterclockwise. Ten, seven, ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Every answer is one point. One point. How many points? One point. Okay, ready. Number one, sweatshirt is it, so looks. Two, pants, they, so look. Three, it's um, fusu, so are. Number four, pants. Five, two words, is and sweatshirt. One to five, any questions? No. no. Six to ten, six is bonus. Seven, yes, the pants and the sweatshirt. Number nine, did you buy or bought? Buy. By only one word, them recently. Six to eleven. Any questions? No. no. All right. Let's continue. So number twelve is yes. I got, got them, them recently. Fifteen to seventeen. When did you buy them? Until seventeen. Any questions? No. All right. Actually, my mom not bought. Not gave. 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 Okay, 18. Who made a mistake? Raise your hands. Do you understand your mistake now? Yes or no? Yes or no? Because of the word to. So you can only write gave. Gave them to me just a while ago. Until 19. Any questions? No. No. Okay, let's continue. Where did your mom buy your pants and sweatshirt? She got them at Sogo on Jojo Road. There is a really nice score there. Write the score out of 25 in 10 seconds. Yes. 23 should be them. Q. I don't understand you. Q. Here. Number 5 has Q. Two answers. If it's wrong, then it's minus one. Yeah. Okay. Write the score. Take out your test books in 10 seconds. 10. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Take out your test book, write 425, and quiz over 25 points, write your score. So like what I said a while ago, notebook, quiz, and then speaking. Are you guys ready for your speaking, yes or no? Yes. Okay, look at me in three seconds. Three, two, one. You're not three minus 20. Three, two, one. Okay, maybe if you guys are good, we can go outside. Okay, maybe. Next, 14 to 16 means you have to write 14 to 16 sentences. Two people, and the topic is wow, your blah 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 look or looks blah 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 blah. Okay, you have 15 minutes to get ready, seven minutes to write, three minutes of practice, five minutes to memorize, and seven minutes and five minutes, only English, only English, only English. I'll let you speak Chinese for three minutes. If you speak Chinese during these times, you get minus three, minus three, minus three. Okay, later class quiz out of 30. Okay, and I'll choose one to two group to come to the front. When they are in front and you are talking, minus one, minus one, minus one. Any questions? Yes or no? I will choose a group for you. I have already done it. No laughing. First group, Aslan, Eileen. Next two, Neil, Jacob, Jacob, Neil. Next one, Henry, Justin. Next one, Celia, Thomas, Thomas. Okay, next, Wilson, Eden. Next, Austin, Maggie. Next, no left. Uni. Don't understand my right. Austin. Okay, next, Oliver, Hunter. Next, Dora. Ian. Next, Mandy. Howard. Next, Ryan. Emily. Next, Royal. Hector. And last two, Eric. Dora. Any questions? Yes or no? no. Okay, everybody stand up. Go to your rooms now. Ten seconds. Ten seconds, please go to your groups. Ten, nine, eight, 
three, two, one. You're not doing minus twenty. Three, two, one. You have two more minutes to write. Is that enough? Yes or no? No. Two plus three minutes. Is that okay? Yes or no? Okay. Okay. During practice, you can write together. Okay. English. Yeah. 